is 15th of August 2010 and we're here. We're at the end of the Famous Bloggers and Comlove contest. It's a blogging contest. We had 38 articles entered. We had hundreds and hundreds of tweets and retweets. We had thousands of comments on the posts. Some posts had more than 100 comments. And we had tens of thousands of page views on those articles. Every blogger that entered learned something new from the other bloggers. It was a fantastic and resounding success. And now we're at the point where we've got people that get real cash money moolah wonga. <laughs> Check it out. We have got 20 winners. We've got over $3,000 in cash prizes. And now all that cash prizes are in Hisham's PayPal account and mine. We're going to put it together and we're going to send it out to the winners. Now, I know you're not even listening about the details. You just want to know who's won. Eh? Who's got the first prize, second prize, third prize, fourth prize, fifth prize, etc. You're going to have to wait for that. It's another couple hours at least. Another two or three hours. Because Hisham's asleep in bed. Because it's the other side of the clock over there in across the pond in the States. And I'm in the UK. And right now it's... Oh, look at that. It's midday. It's the exact time we said that we would announce the winners of the contest. So, what's going to happen today? You're going to watch this, and then you're going to go over to Hisham's blog, and you're going to see the list of winners. Now, the list of winners is in no particular order. We're just going to show you the 20 winners. And before we tell you who won first prize, second prize, and third prize, and so on, you need to understand how these winners were chosen. Now, Hisham has put a huge amount of work into this, and all the while he was collating points from the judges and tweets and comments and stuff, he didn't know who had written each article that he was collating points on. It was all numbers. He did the numbers. It wasn't until the very end, when he'd found out first, second, third, fourth, fifth, that he then find out what name was attached to this number. So that made it all fair for everyone. Now, the way it was done was we had judges. Now, if you remember back in the first video, the crazy video that I made there in my man cave space camp, which is slightly different now. Do you like the blue? Hmm? Anyway... How was it done? I shall tell you. The judges judged each article and they gave it points out of 10. Then they sent their points over to Hisham and Hisham made the average for each article. That scored the articles. Out of all the 38 articles, we chose the best 20 based on the highest average points they got from the judges. This is the best way. If you remember I said it was a blogging contest. It was an article writing contest. It wasn't a how many tweets you can get contest, it wasn't how many comments you can get contest, it wasn't how many followers you've got contest, it was a blogging contest. So if you wrote a good article, and it was better than this person's article that just so happened to have a hundred million Twitter followers, you would win, and they wouldn't, because your article was better. That is important. Now once we discovered the 20 best articles based on judges' points, then comments, tweets, retweets, responses to comments and so on went into adding the bonus points to those articles so we could find the position of each of those people. So that's important. Remember that. Don't be complaining. The best articles win. If we did it based on the number of tweets or comments people got before we judged the article, that means that someone with 100 million Twitter followers or a really busy popular blog already could write hamburger as their entry and they could win because they got 6 million retweets. That wouldn't be fair. So, it's important you understand that. That was the, how it was going to be from the very beginning. A blogging contest is a blogging contest, not a Twitter contest. Right? So, no complaints. What are we going to do now? Well, you're going to see the list of people that win. You're not going to see what positions they got yet until later. Unless you're watching this later, in which case you will see the positions of people that win now. So, congratulations to all the winners. You'll find out who you are later, just by checking over at famousbloggers.net. A few hours after that gets published, I'm going to send a newsletter out to all the people that are subscribed to the comlove.com newsletter. There's over 11,000 at the moment. Now I'm going to tell them to come and see Famous Bloggers and comlove.com. And now hopefully, by then, we will have who has first, second, third, all the way down to 20. And you will know who's won hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds, and hundreds of dollars. we are given away thousands of dollars. I may have mentioned that before. I'll say it again. We're giving away thousands of dollars and we got the money already. So if you're a winner, congratulations. 
send us your PayPal address. You're going to probably send that to Hisham because he's been working hard, tirelessly, really freaking hard on this contest. He hasn't slept some nights. He's just had to work so hard. I don't think he's ever sent so many emails before in his life. Gail has been editing posts like mad. She's been editing posts and retweeting and promoting and providing ways for people to make it easier for them to promote their own posts. Okay? So, if you win, send your money to them. <laughs> oh, I'm just kidding. Keep your money. Buy something nice for yourself, for your family, for your children, for your lover, for your mum, for your dad, for your auntie, for your dog, for your cat. Meow. Do something good with your money because this is pennies from heaven if you believe in that kind of thing. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Or it could be, you know, stuff. Money from moolah. Money moolah, wonga 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 cash. Ka-ching, ka-ching, ka-ching. Buy yourself something nice. Congratulations. Feel great about yourself. And come back to famousbloggers.net and comlove.com again and again and again and say, oh, we love this stuff. Because we might have another contest. And next time you enter early, next time you follow the rules of the contest or you get eliminated. Someone is kicking themselves now because they got eliminated. Because they didn't put post of the sponsors on their own post. Silly Billy. So, next time you hear about the contest from famousbloggers.net or comlove.com or us two together, enter early. Follow the rules. Get yourself some money. <laughs>